बदलना चाहिए बीजेपी तो मतलब चांस नहीं नहीं वो तो खत्म हो गया करीमनगर होम टू ओवर थ्री लाख पीपल द फिफ्थ लार्जेस्ट सिटी इन तेलंगाना एंड वन ऑफ द टाउन चूज इन फॉर द स्मार्ट सिटी प्रोजेक्ट द डिवेलपमेंट इज क्लियर द बसनिंग रोड्स एंड द इंफ्रास्ट्रक्चर सो हु गेट्स क्रेडिट फॉर करीमनगर डेवलपमेंट एम पी बंडी संजय और एम एल ए गंगलो कमलाकर This clash is one to watch out for as BRS MLA Kamlakar a strong man in Karimnagar squares off against BJP's Bandi Sanjay who's contesting this assembly election from his MP seat. So who does Karimnagar choose? Our first stop is a BRS rally for Minister Kamlakar. This is a dull moment in Telangana politics especially when you're covering a BRS rally. All these beautiful women you see around me have gathered for BRS MLA Gangula Kamlakar's rally. They're playing Kolatam. What you know as Dandia here locally is called Kolatam and it's an essential feature of Telangana politics of BRS rallies as well. But does all the dance, all of this pomp translate to votes for Gangula Kamlakar? Very much so. He is eyeing a fourth term as MLA from this very seat, from Karim Nagar. So this is going to be an uphill task for Bandi Sanjay Kumar to overcome the Kamlakar factor. The town is painted pink, BRS colours in anticipation of Kamlakar. Clear to us why he's a three-time MLA now looking for a fourth term. Women with fresh sandal rubbed on their cheeks wear pink caps and shawls, dancing and making merry. Kamlakar arrives to a hero's welcome. Amid a flash shower, he skips the campaign vehicle and goes straight into the waiting crowd. He greets them all personally, dances with them, plays the drums with them. Uh, Kamlakar ji, we have seen your whole rally. So, what is your secret? Are you a success? Are you a punch dialogue? Are you a popularity? Logo se, developing? Basically, I am an engineer, civil engineer. Public kya chahte ki ek MLA chunne ke baad no public ki kam karna, personal kam nahi karna. तो मैं कम से कम दो बार मैं मुंसिपल कॉर्पोरेटर हूँ जब से पब्लिक से रिलेशन है उसके बाद मैं तीन बार मैं एम एल ए हूँ तीन बार भी मैं पब्लिक के लिए काम कर रहा तो हर इलेक्शन में क्यों जीता है बोलते हो एक इलेक्शन जीतने के बाद पब्लिक क्या चाहते रोड्स कैसा होना पानी क्या प्रॉब्लम है उसको जो चाहते वो हम लड़के लेके आ सकते या हम रूलिंग गवर्नमेंट हो या अपोजिशन हो लड़के लेके आके पब्लिक काम करे बोल के तीन बार मैंने जीता है सिर्फ कोई भी पब्लिक काम करे तो उसको जीता दे ये चौथा बार भी हम लड़ रहे पब्लिक भी मेरे वोट दाते वो जीता दे क्यों बोलते उसको उम्मीद है एक बार जीतने के बाद इतना अच्छा काम करा और एक बार जीतने के बाद भी हमारा काम करते बोल के वो लोग हमारा वोट देते सीक्रेट क्या इस चुनाव थोड़ा डिफरेंट है क्योंकि आपने पहले भी बांटी संजय के खिलाफ लड़ाई लड़ाई हो और दो बार आपने हार दिया उनको लेकिन इस बार ही इज ए मेंबर ऑफ पार्लियामेंट तो उससे क्या कुछ फर्क पड़ रहा है ग्राउंड पे नहीं नहीं उन्होंने मेंबर ऑफ पार्लियामेंट होने के बाद और ग्राफ इसका गिर गए साढ़े चार साल हो गए मेंबर ऑफ पार्लियामेंट के पब्लिक को कोई रिलेशन नहीं है बहुत करप्शन कर दिया तो उसको करप्शन कर दिया बोल के उसको स्टेट प्रेसिडेंट निकाल दिया निकाल के फेंक दिया तो उसी तो उसको ग्राफ डाउन हो गए तो साढ़े चार साल में उन्होंने चुनाव होने के बाद एम है वो वहाँ मोदी का गवर्नमेंट से क्या एक करोड़ रुपए लेके क्या करने के लिए फिर उसको कहीं को वोट देना तो साढ़े चार साल में कुछ नहीं करेगा तो उसको वोट मिला था एमपी ऐसे ही बनाया था तो वही एक बार गिर गए हार्ट अटैक तो तो एक बार हार्ट फेल हो गए बोल के अपोलो में आसपास जैन हो गए तो सिंपति गेन करा दो बार हार गए बोल के एक बार देखेंगे बोल के डाल दिया देखने बाद उसका नियत पूरा बदल गए साढ़े चार साल में एक रुपए भी नहीं लेके आए साढ़े चार साल पब्लिक रिलेशन है ये फिर इस बार आके हमारे वोट दे तो पब्लिक देने वाला नहीं है अवेयरनेस पूरा सब लोग अवेयरनेस है सो हार्मोस्टल इज इन थर्ड पोजिशन 
पंडित संजय ज्यादातर उनके रैलीज में हिंदुत्व के ऊपर लड़ रहा है तो आपके काउंटर उसके लिए क्या है हम भी हिंदू हैं मैं जो हिंदू लोग हैं क्या भी हिंदू मुसलमान मारने के लिए कोई बोलता है क्या तो हिंदू मुसलमान लड़ाई हो तो क्या होता निश्चय होता है वन फोर्टी सेक्शन होता है तो अमन शांति बिगड़ जाता है हम क्या चाहते हैं एम हो एम जीतने के बाद पब्लिक को काम करो जनता को काम करो हमारे कॉन्सेस को काम करो लेकिन हिंदू मुसलमान लड़ाई कितना दिन बाहर बोलते रहते कितना दिन ये सब चलता है हर एक आदमी वोट लेके आज से हिंदू मुसलमान से जड़े वगैरह करते ये पब्लिक भी सबको मालूम है अभी इस बार तो कोई भी मानने वाला भी नहीं है तो सब लोग हिंदू है हम भी बड़े बड़े घर मंदिर बना रहे तो हिंदू बोल के बता रहे ना तो हम वेंकटेश्वर टेम्पल बना रहे श्री राम कृष्ण टेम्पल बना रहे तो इन्हें क्या टेम्पल बनाए अभी तक एक करोड़ भी लेके आए क्या कुछ भी नहीं तो इन्हें खाली मंदिर और हिंदू का नाम पे वोट लेने के लिए है करेप्टिव है वेरी बिग करेप्टिव सो इस बार उन्होंने हार जा रहे हैं Kamlakar has got a firm grip over Karimnagar and that's what makes this fight between MP and MLA interesting. In such a circumstance there are also questions over the minority vote. If the minority vote chooses BRS then it's game over for BJP but if it gets split between the BRS and Congress then it's advantage BJP. So the minority vote matters in Karimnagar in such a circumstance especially because it could be split between the BRS and the Congress let's find out from the ground what people think Namaste sahab Congress ke liye acha aap to pata chala ki main kya baat karne wali hu aap karne aapke hand pe samajh rahe hain Congress ko kyun Congress badalna chahiye acha badalna chahiye yes yes acha aur BJP to matlab chance nahi nahi wo to khatam ho uska bonda bolte na खबर खबर अच्छा आप एक चीज बताइए कांग्रेस क्यों सिर्फ बदल की वजह से सिर्फ क्योंकि आपको थोड़ा सा मार्क चाहिए कुछ नहीं बदलना चाहिए कुछ हर एक का हर एक सेकेंड आपका मतलब शॉपकीपर जो है यहाँ पे बोल रहे हैं कि आपको नहीं देंगे क्योंकि आप कांग्रेस बोल रहे हो नहीं नहीं हम टी आर एस बोल रहे कमलाकर जी को वापस कमलाकर फिर वापस क्यों लेकिन वो इतने अच्छे काम किए कौन किए फिर ये रोड देख लो हर चीज देख लो और आपको लगता है कि कांग्रेस अरे आए तो आएंगे कांग्रेस कांग्रेस न्याय दूसरे इलाके में आएगा यहाँ पे अगर न्याय तो भी ये नया कैंडिडेट है वो कांग्रेस आप बोल रहे हो यहाँ पे कांग्रेस नहीं आएगा बोल नहीं सकते बॉर्डर बॉर्डर में वो क्यूँकी हाँ बहुत खतरनाक प्लेयर है वो कौन बहुत सारे चीजें उसका बोले तो एक डिक्शनरी लिखना पड़ता है अच्छा किसको नहीं किसके बारे में आप बात कर रहे हो बी के बारे में या कांग्रेस के बारे में नहीं नहीं बी का बी अच्छा। का क्या है वो ठीक है हाँ। मगर बीच में जरा वो हो गया उसका अच्छा। दूसरे कोई इलाके में नहीं आएगा वो तो आप बोल रहे हो आप कांग्रेस के लिए जी हाँ कांग्रेस का ही कांग्रेस नहीं आएंगे फिर बी आर एस फिर हम मिलेंगे मुलाकात करेंगे तीन तारीख के दिन रात में टेल एस हु डू यू सपोर्ट मैम हियर इन करीम I would support BRS party. Why? Uh, because they have gained trust uh, okay. for last few years, and there have been a lot of uh, development works uh, for all section of people. Hmm. And uh, we have got a cable bridge. I think that's uh, one of the thing which brought a spotlight on Karim Nagar. And we we all love Karim Nagar, and hmm. uh, we love seeing development in Karim Nagar, and we see uh, that hope and trust in uh, Kamlakar, and that's why we would go for. Uh, what about the Congress? Uh, we all know the history. <laughs> so uh, right now, I think um, for last uh, one decade. we have seen lot of development works so me being a it professional i do not know lot of politics out there but as a citizen if i look around um, and compare past developments and if i see karimnagar or telangana now i see lot of uh, development has happened in terms of infrastructure in terms of uh, you know uh, gaining uh, Uh, actually reaching out to the scopes or areas which were untouched hmm. during previous governments so maybe dalits and uh, farmers you know they have got a lot they have got lot of support from this government what do you mean when you say we all know what congress is history so as i said i'm not very good at history but i saw the when uh, congress was a ruling party i didn't see so many developments so right now even if you ask uh, small children they know mm-hmm. why is karimnagar famous 
so they they'll talk yeah they see a lot of development here and they uh, see that you know there is a scope of development once it is uh, a pure smart city okay so what about you sir who will you back and who are you supporting acha hindi mein bataiye aap kisko support kar rahe hain and brs ko karenge acha kyu kyu dekh rahe hain hum last year se yahan par kai saalon se jab se hukumat mein hain बहुत अच्छे तरक्की के काम हुए और मैं एक मस्जिद में इमाम भी हूँ तो कई लोग मुझसे मिलते भी हैं तो लोगों के सारे दिल बिहार के साथ हैं तो इस मरतबा बी आर एस यकीनी तौर पर जीते पीछे सब बोल रहे हैं कि शायद माइनॉरिटीज डिसाइड करेंगे कि करीम नगर कैसे जाएंगे डू यू थिंक सो यस ऑफकोर्स बिकॉज माइनॉरिटी या वी माइनॉरिटीज आर सपोर्टिंग बी आर एस बिकॉज बी आर एस गवर्नमेंट एंड करंट एम एल एम बी सी मिनिस्टर गंगुला कमलाकर हैज डन लॉट फॉर लॉट फॉर द माइनॉरिटीज एंड माइनॉरिटी एरियाज द करंट रोड यू आर सींग इन द डिकेड ऑफ इन द पीरियड ऑफ कांग्रेस दे हैव कोलेब्स दिस रोड अंडर द नेम ऑफ अंडरग्राउंड ड्रेनेज सो once this uh, government has uh, taken up they have built all the roads again so they have rebuilt all the roads they they are not only rebuilding the roads they are on, they are rebuilding complete telangana now. so it's uh, not 100% golden telangana but they are building uh, telangana to the golden golden way दे इज अ लॉट ऑफ टॉक और काफ़ी मतलब बात हो रहा है एंटी इनकम्बेंसी के बारे में कि यहाँ पे करीमनगर में कमलाकर के शायद ये फोर्थ टर्म है जो मांग रहे हैं तो क्या आपको नहीं लगता है कि थोड़ा सा चेंज होनी चाहिए किसी और को चांस देने नहीं नहीं जब अच्छा कर रहे हैं तो चेंज करने की जरूरत क्या है ठीक है तो हम तो चेंजेस नहीं चाहेंगे वो हमारे साथ अच्छा काम कर रहे हैं तो हम भी उनके साथ रहना चाहेंगे सर जी आप बताइए ना ये ठीक है आपका ही वोट है ना तो आप बताइए किसके लिए वोट करेंगे आप उनको मत देखिए कांग्रेस या बी आर एस आप किसके लिए वोट डाल बी आर एस को अच्छा उनके काम अच्छा लगता है अब बी आर एस ओके सो यू हर्ट सम ऑफ द व्यूज हर मैनी ऑफ दम सेम बी आर एस आप सब में से बी आर एस के लिए वोट है या कांग्रेस हाथ से बी आर एस बी आर एस अच्छा मॉरल एस बी आर एस या देर आर अफ यू हुआ सेंग नो वी नीड चेंज बट मैन द वर्ड चेंज कम्स फ्रॉम द माइनॉरिटी it translates to the bjp to the congress they say that these rallies being held across telangana come alive in the evening so most of the netas when you tell them that you know we're here to cover what's happening with your constituency they tell us come visit us in the night we visited brs mla gangula kamlakar's rally in the morning you saw the color around i've come now to karim nagar mp bandi sanjay kumar the former bjp chief of telangana's rally here in karim nagar in the night and i must say i'm a tad disappointed look around me the crowds are very very low there's a lot of music in the air talking about nationalism talking about hindutva talking about the telangana cause as well but the crowds here not really up beat emotional and the numbers are much less i is this indicative really of the votes that pandit sanjay will get is this indicative of the support he has in karim nagar time will tell but for now i must tell you when i compare this rally with the brs or the congress it's nowhere in the same league we then visit the bjp rally in the heart of karim nagar city crowd swelling up in the evening as the street is painted in saffron meri chapendi meru bjp ki enduku support chesesi untaru ikkada ब्रह्मांड प्रचार अंगरंग वैभव बंट संजय करीम नगर असैंती अभ्यर्थि बीजेपी अभ्यर्थि पोराट विप्ल उद्यम कट पैंत पोरा जैल को प्रजा संक्षेम कोसम पाठ पड़े व्यक्ति प्रजा ममेक चलमुत ग्राम वेला मंद महिला योधा योधन स्टूडेंट विद्यार्थुन कोसम तपे तलपे तपक असैंती मेरी एंड की बंटी संजय कार्य की सपोर्ट चेस तारों वाल एमपी का इकड़ा ये एम पानी चेस तारों में की बंटी संजय का रास्ता अन्य पनल मंच का जरूर बताओ यानी इस चम्मच को दी चेस सुनना फिर मुख्य अंगा यो जाप सोचता ही निकाल से लड़ाई हो तब 
बंटी संजय अभी सीट में लड़ रहे हैं तो एस एन एम पी आपके लिए क्या किया है अब तक अभी तो अच्छा है क्या किया है लेकिन किया बोले तो हाँ तो नहीं मालूम अच्छा लेकिन आप खुश हो खुश है तो आप क्यों बीजेपी को सपोर्ट क्यों रहे बीजेपी क्यों क्यों बोले तो हमारे को अच्छा लग रहा है ना उसके लिए अच्छा अच्छा आपके लिए प्रॉब्लम तो कुछ प्रॉब्लम नहीं है बहुत फैंस हो गए हेलो बोलिए मैडम आपके लिए क्या मुद्दा है इस चुनाव में करीम नगर में करीम नगर में ये मुद्दा है कि करीम नगर में अभी जो ये गंगला कमला का एमएलए है उन्होंने पूरा गुंडा कर दी और कांग्रेस का एमएलए दोनों मिलके सारी लैंड पूरा कब्जा कर लिया अपना बंडी संजय जो है एमपी है उन्होंने करीम नगर के लिए रेलवे ओवर ब्रिज लेके आया और वरंगल टू करीम नगर करीम नगर तक रेलवे लाइन लेके आया लेकिन कमलाकर बोलते हैं कि मैं केबल ब्रिज लेकर आई हूँ जो करीम नगर की सबसे खूबसूरत जगह वो जो केबल ब्रिज बना है ना केबल ब्रिज ऑलरेडी एक बार पूरा क्रैक्स आ गया उनका काम ऐसा रहता मगर बंडी संजय का जब काम देखे आप जाके अभी भी देख सकते रेलवे स्टेशन के पास रेलवे ओवर ब्रिज बन रहे कितना क्वालिटी के साथ बन रहे जो कमलाकर जो बनाया पूरा जो भी काम करा पूरा काम कब्जा करके करा और जो भी है कुछ भी पूरा क्वालिटी नहीं है क्वांटिटी भी नहीं है वो जो रिवर फ्रंट बना रहा है उसमें भी क्वालिटी नहीं है आप बताइए आपके लिए विकास है मुद्दा या हिंदुत्व है विकास और हिंदुत्व दोनों है और ये केंद्र प्रभुत्व स्मार्ट सिटी निधुला तप राष्ट्र प्रभुत्म के निधम आरओबी यानी स्मार्ट इश्यू डेवलपमेंट हिंदुत्व डेवलपमेंट डेवलपमेंट अंड स्मार्ट सिटी निधुला प्रभुत्व स्मार्ट सिटी निधुला करीमनगर डेवलप तप राष्ट्र प्रभुत्म वाटा एमी ले रूपये स्मार्ट सिटी प्राजेक्ट करीम नगर मेनी से Because of Mr. Kamlakar, including the cable bridge. Yeah, all the smart city or the central funds have been diverted to Kaleshwar. That even if you ask a kid, they'll know that every NP that has been sent from the central government has been diverted to either Kaleshwaram, which is which is from 30 lakh crores to grown to around 1 lakh 30 30 lakh crores. And you have you have other other schemes as well where the money has been diverted. So there is no smart city development that has been done by the state government. So you are saying what that the government, state government or central government, which has it? No, state is responsible to take the funds and spend it on development. So they have not done it. You are saying no. They they, they have got the money. What has Bandi Sanjay done for you? Here? So Bandi Sanjay have got around nine thousand crores of funds. You have RUBs, you have railway stations, you have uh, highways that have been built right now from Barangal to Karim Nagar. So there is nine thousand crores of funds. Apart from that, during COVID, all the MP lads have been given to the hospitals here in Kavri Karim Nagar. We have three crores of money, which Bandi Sanjay's own money he spent in ambulances during COVID. Bandi Sanjay is the only MP uh, initially who went to the government hospital before even CM went to a government Very hospital during road. peak COVID. Okay. He was the one. As this, so you are happy with this performance? Hundred and ten percent. Okay, so all of you are happy with Bandi Sanjay. Yeah. Okay, so that's the mood on the ground. But this is a BJP rally. You can see that all of them are saying that Bandi Sanjay has performed as an MP. That's why we want him to win again as an MLA. As Bandi Sanjay nears the venue, the beats and the dancing take space. <laughs> The 
women throng the BGP AP for selfies as chants of Jai Shri Ram resonate. <laughs> After a struggle and endless jostling, we finally reach Bhatti Sanjay. Sir, first of all, I have a full day here in Karimnagar. What are the main issues here in Karimnagar? I have a PRS party. I have a PRS party. I have a PRS party. I have a Telangana Rasalo. I have a PRS party. I have a PRS party. I have a PRS party. Karimnagar Assembly News Organ. Karimnagar Parliament. I have a member of Parliament. I have a PRS party. I have a PRS party. I have a PRS party. पूर्ति का पंजालू भारतीय जनता पार्टी अनुकूल होना है। मोदी राज्यम तेलंगाना राष्ट्रों को रावण जी पियोगा आलोचन पंजाल नहीं करना। बीआरएस पार्टी ये लोग खबर जाल के बाल पड़ते थे, अभी भी जाकर मालूम पाल पड़ते थे। कांग्रेस पार्टी अब बैठी है वो रे वो रे तलवारी। वाले इधर उड़ा लैंड कब्जा अगर पूर्ति का पंजाब जो बड़ा भारतीय जनता पर जनकोले का पूर्ति जनकोले का ये लोग वोट वेदन सिद्ध होना है भारी मैच जो कैप्टन सिद्ध होना है मेरा दूसरा जाल पड़ जाएगा दूसरा आवन चाल क्राउड होंगे इलाकों टेम मेरे कड़े एमपी का दा ये पूरा एमएलए इलेक्शन लो उन्हें आरो इधर तगिया पाम एक पार्टी ये तो निन्ने जिसको ना दानी कंट्रोल में ना सब बाजार था पार्टी कमिट पड़ी का लगाने का तरह ना बाजार दिखा बटी चिन्ना पैदा ये हम लोग दिखा रहे हैं सब ये निकल जाते हैं जब फोन आसमान पर आते हैं तो पोटी आते हैं पोटी आसमान के लिए एक ना ये हम चाहिए लेते हो वाले इन केबल ब्रिज कंस्ट्रक्शन ना रो वाले इन एक ना फुल डेवलपमेंट चीज़ था वो लेकेबल ब्रिज है क्या था स्मार्ट सिटी पैसे लोरी आरोग्य पैसे लोरी नेशनल लेवल पैसे लोरी इसको चिरू बीएम बनाए राइस पैसे लोरी ग्रामीण ना सड़क पे रोड ऐसा पैसे लोरी सीआरओ पैसे लोरी वरंगल दान छुट्टी पर कर बोल कम जाए इसे आने तो आए ना उपकरण का था गवर्नमेंट आसपास बिजली पैसे लोरी स्मार्ट सिटी पैसे ले एंजेशन ने मोटर तो नष्ट नहीं करा अने इप्पी तो करे सस्पेंशन भी जोकरे का था एंजेशन तो करे क्या रहती कन्नड़ वोड़े बोल पोतना आए ना उपकरण का था मेरे इकड़ करीम नगर लो ना ने हाई तो बाद नीचे करीम नगर हो चेस थी नहीं मेरे मीट चेस थे कि मेरे यंत्र को इकड़ करीम नगर लो मात्रों कैंपेन चेस तरह सर फुल तेलंगाना ले ले दो नहीं ना नहीं मुद्दम के तेलंगाना मुद्दम जरूर तो ना मार्निंग को डेल हेले क्या पर लो मुद्दम तेलंगाना मुद्दम जरूर � मेजारी सीट होती है यंता मेजारी सीट होती है क्या रहता है नंबर ही चेंडी नंबर सीट तो नंबर ही क्या रहता है इलेक्शन स्टेंड साथ है दिया था और ये मेजारी सीट होती है गवर्नमेंट होती है इकड़े करीम नगर लो माइनॉरिटी वोट्स चाली डिस्कशन होंगे कि माइनॉरिटी वोट्स डिसाइड फैक्टर उन्होंन कांग्रेस एमए पार्टी कांग्रेस बीआरएस पार्टी लीडर बोला 12 परसेंट उन्हें मैंने डिस्कस करना बोलता हूँ क्योंकि 80 परसेंट हिंदू लोगों ने विषय नहीं बिल्कुल मस्त होते हिंदू वोट बैंक वाले को नमक के लेते हिंदू समाज जब ने चुड़कन उस तरह हिंदू वोट वोट वाला हिंदू वोट वोट वाला बोली � the Karimnagar battle is one of the few seats where we'll see a direct BRS versus BJP two-way tucker. Can Bandi Sanjay, who's lost twice to BRS's Kamlakar in 2014 and 2018, change his fortunes a third time? <laughs> watching India today powered by Finest be sustainable change a BNP group company I feel like a Jaipur Maharaja nothing like an early morning walk to get the energy going 
चीफ मिनिस्टर कौन बनेगा अभी फिफ्टी अभी फिफ्टी फिफ्टी तो मैंने बिस्किट सुने मॉर्निंग वॉक डन टाइम फॉर सम राजस्थानी ब्रेकफास्ट एट टपरी बीजेपी एकदम बिखरी हुई मैं इस पद को छोड़ने जाता हूँ पद बोले नहीं छोड़ रहा है एंजॉय देसी घी बाजरे की रोटी काम पे भी लड़ा जाएगा और विकास पे भी लड़ा जाएगा You are watching India Today, powered by Finest B Sustainable Change, a BNP Group company. Six meter uh, distance, 800 diameter of this pipe, and the reporter is going inside. Amit Bharadwaj is inside, and now let's count the seconds that it takes. It's now going to be three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, and on twenty-fifth second, Amit was able to cross the six-meter length. Now, this also depends on the fitness of those workers, and they must be really very exhausted, totally isolated, quarantined in a dark tunnel. what was the experience amit in just 6 meter of this you know uh, this is a difficult journey ashutosh uh, i have just taken one of the 10 uh, uh, tunnels that will be that is being installed inside uh, uh, the silkiara tunnel right now and uh, let me tell you you know when you come from one distance uh, to the other this is 6 meter long so as i uh, reach the other end uh, uh, you start feeling a sort of difficulty in breathing and i'm sure people who are inside stuck 41 workers for 11 days 11 past days uh, they would not be in the, uh, their best of uh, health uh, 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 physical going, strength you already going yes. breathless i can see yes <laughs> and they they have to cover the distance of 60 meters 10 such pipes so that is going to be a, diff a major difficulty but the ndrf has its uh, backup plan installed as well uh, i'll request deepak to come closer uh, to this uh, particular you know uh, uh, rescue tunnel that's uh, being installed inside uh, uh, the silkiara tunnel right now uh, you know what we are given to understand it's a sort of a telescopic uh, uh, model that is being used i feel like a jaipur maharaja aap to mere bodyguard ban gaye hain tiger zinda hai 
Nothing like an early morning walk to get the energy going. Chief Minister, who will become? Fifty-fifty, Avi. Fifty-fifty. So I heard biscuits. Morning walk done. Time for some Rajasthani breakfast at Tapri. Saffron chai. BJP एकदम बिखरी हुई है। मैं इस पद को छोड़ना चाहता हूँ। वो इस पद बुरे नहीं छोड़ रहा है। Enjoy देसी घी बाजरे की रोटी। काम पे भी लड़ा जाएगा और विकास पे भी लड़ा जाएगा। Good evening. Thank you for joining us live here on India Today. I'm Akshita Nantakopal. This evening, I'm joining you live from Nizamabad district in Telangana. And as I travel across the length and breadth of the state, we'll be getting you constant ground reports to tell you what's the mood here on the ground. We played out for you what's happening in Karim Nagar. Tomorrow, of course, will be a ground report from here, from Nizamabad. Lots of big political headlines also emerging right now from Telangana, which is days to go for voting on November 30th. Let's get you the latest latest piece of breaking news coming in. All right, what we're seeing now is a fight between the Congress and the BRS and the Telangana Congress has now put out a post on social media claiming that they've caught KTR confessing that things aren't looking good in his constituency of Sirsila. Now, an audio clip has been released by the Congress. They're claiming it's KTR. We can't verify the authenticity of this audio clip. So we'll just play out for you what the Telangana Congress is saying. Uh, they've released this audio clip in which purportedly KTR can be heard saying that people are writing my political obituary. He's referring to what's happening in Sirsila constituency, saying we will lose if we don't campaign harder. This audio clip which Congress has released has sent ripples across. We're awaiting a BRS reaction, but the Congress is claiming that this is KTR confirming that the BRS is losing in Telangana. Let's play out for you that audio clip. Once again, let me highlight that this has been released by the Congress. <laughs> सीरियस का दिलचस्प नहीं है उस्ता दी मानो राष्ट्र मुद्दा में जुस्ता होने सिरसिला वाई पुक सिरसिला ने ने ओरे पोतु ना राष्ट्र ने गास ताई की राष्ट्र कार्डिक बोइंग दिए ने मानलो मानो में ये राना उस रंग का मार्टल मार्टल अर्थ रंग आउट बंदा जरूरत आउंगी ये वरु वटिस कोड मानो नो नष्ट पर ये दी मा� काबटे दहेज़ नहीं मिल मिल कोरें दी वार एंड रोज़ लो फिर चाला सिंसियर का चाला वोल हार्टेड का डोर टू डोर तिरगंडी कुसोंडी so this particular audio clip is now doing the rounds. Telangana Congress has released it saying that this is KT Rama Rao uh, very frustratedly referring to what's happening in Sirsila, saying uh, that people are saying that, you know, it's time for me to end my career. They're writing my political obituary saying I'm not getting enough support. This audio is now something that, of course, we'll await reactions on from the BRS. They're yet to confirm whether it's KT Rama Rao or not. But this opens up a new political front altogether and a fresh face-off between the Congress and the BRS. How did the Telangana Congress get this kind of an audio? There's been no confirmation yet of whether it indeed is KTR as a fact Congress claims. According to the Congress, this is a conversation that KTR was having with his own carter saying that they need to stop in fighting. They all need to work together. And he's also saying uh, in this audio that uh, it's very embarrassing for me, that it doesn't look like I have any support on the ground in Sirsila. Now, this is the claim that's being put forth by the Congress at a time when, of course, political campaigning is at an all-time high. And we've been seeing rather personal bickering, personal vindictive attacks against each other, particularly between the Congress and the BRS, where, in fact, it's descended to this level where K KCR, the Telangana Chief Minister and the Telangana Congress Chief Revant Reddy have resorted to calling each other dogs as well. Uh, as we in fact await a BRS reaction on this, I want to once again play out for you exactly what this audio clip has, what it contains, what the Telangana Congress is alleging here. They're claiming it's KTR. Listen carefully to their audio. <laughs> गतमलो माध्यमिक आकुण्डा मिक एक्सेस बोल गोड़ उन्टा नो कनी वारन रोज़ दहेज़ मीरु सीरियस का दिल इतने आयी उस तरी मानो राष्ट्र मुद्दा में जुस्ता होने सिरसिला वाई पुक सिरसिला ने ने ओरे पोतना राष्ट्र ने गास ताई की राष्ट्र कार्डिक बोइंग दिए ने मानलो मानो में ये राना उस रंग का मार्टल मार्टल अर्थ रंग आउट बंद
కాబట్టి దయచేసి నేను మిమ్మల్ని కోరేది ఈ వారం రోజులు మీరు చాలా సిన్సియర్ గా చాలా ఓల్ హార్టెడ్ గా డోర్ టు డోర్ తిరగండి కూర్చోండి వారానికి రెండు రోజులు కనీసంగా నేను వస్తాను సిరిసిల్లలోనే ఉంటాను గతంలో మాదిరి కాకుండా మీకు యాక్సెసబుల్ గా కూడా ఉంటాను కానీ ఈ వారం రోజులు దయచేసి మీరు సీరియస్ గా తిరిగితేనే అది వస్తుంది మనం రాష్ట్రం మొత్తం చూస్తా ఉంది సిరిసిల్ల వైపు సిరిసిల్ల నేను ఓడిపోతున్నాను రాసిండు గా స్థాయికి రాసే కాడికి పోయింది అంటే మనలో మనమే ఈ అనవసరంగా మాటలు మాట్లాడుతున్నాం కాబట్టి ఇదంతా జరుగుతా ఉంది ఎవరూ పట్టించుకోవడం మనను నష్టపోయేది మనందరం కాబట్టి దయచేసి నేను మిమ్మల్ని కోరేది ఈ వారం రోజులు మీరు చాలా సిన్సియర్ గా చాలా ఓల్ హార్టెడ్ గా డోర్ టు డోర్ తిరగండి కూర్చోండి So you hear their audio clip purportedly of KTR appealing to everyone to work together saying that people are writing my political obituary in my constituency of Sirsala from where he's fighting yet again Abdul Bashir is joining us with more details on this Abdul any reaction that's coming from the BRS is there confirmation that this indeed is KTR's audio as claimed by the Congress See well Akshita this audio that has been released reportedly uh, is a conversation between KTR and he is you know uh, talking to his cadres he sent a voice message is what uh, it can be seen from what uh, you know it has been posted by the Telangana Congress here whether it whether it is a genuine audio or not the BRS has to reply uh, no reply no they have not responded to it yet but what conversation that is going on between KTR and what he is trying to convey is there is some kind of uh, in in fighting between the cadre in Sirsilla a uh, constituency from where KTR is uh, set to contest the upcoming elections and he's already an MLA from Sirsilla and uh, as he is not able to give time to the people at Sirsilla he has promised that after this elections uh, he will at least uh, visit Sirsilla twice in a week is what he's uh, conveying through this audio and also apart from that what we see is that uh, the infighting of uh, uh, the congress leaders uh, is uh, causing a lot of uh, you know a trembling in the cadre is what he's been to say so this audio uh, reportedly a uh, conversation a not a conversation but a voice message by ktr to his cadre in sirsilla uh, and all uh, is 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 uh, posted by the telangana congress uh, in uh, in the for, for this upcoming elections All right uh, Abdul we'll track the latest reactions that come in on this there's been no comment yet from the BRS but Abdul giving us more details of exactly what's been mentioned in that audio clip that's now going viral and request you to stay on with me uh, Abdul because we'll cut across to more breaking news coming in right now from Telangana All right there's been a massive controversy over Akbaruddin Owaisi who last night while holding his rally was told to stop as he was nearing the deadline of 10 pm he then openly threatened a cop saying if i give the direction you will have to run because everyone will attack you he threatened a cop openly Akbaruddin Owaisi has now come out with this version even as an FIR has been filed against him he's filed a counter complaint against the police officials because he claims that he had valid permission to go ahead with his rally uh, in fact in a high Rabat uh, Owaisi Jr has now filed a complaint saying that the EC must take action against the cops who were involved claiming that the action against him the attempt by the cop to stop his rally was motivated i want to in fact play out for you the clarification that's come in from Owaisi Jr now the time 10 baje tak hai agar hum 10 baje ke baad mein agar speech dete hain to unka ikhtiyar hai लॉ है वो केस बुक कर सकते हैं डायरेक्ट किसी के पब्लिक मीटिंग में स्टेज पर चढ़कर आ जाना और बोलना कि टाइम हो गया है तो ये तो गलत बात है पुलिस को ऐसा करना नहीं चाहिए और इससे साफ जाहिर होता है कि पुलिस पार्शल है या इम्पार्शल है Okay so that's the defense that's coming from Akbaruddin Owaisi I want to take this across to Abdul Bashir for more details so Abdul that video of course of Akbaruddin went viral where he was threatening a cop very clearly saying if you don't get out from here you're going to be attacked I just have to give the call and you'll have to run for your life unacceptable kind of a, you know a comment to be made at a police official who was doing his duty but Akbaruddin is saying that I had permission so he's trying to claim here that the cop's action was completely motivated Yes absolutely see Akbaruddin Nawasi yesterday while his uh Uh, address public address in Lalita Bagh of uh, Chandrayaan Gutta Santosh Nagar police station limits where uh, the the permission 
called the uh, public address was 10 o'clock, but just 10 minutes before uh, prior uh, to 10 o'clock, that is 9.55 to 9, 9.50 to 9.55, a uh, cop, uh, the Santoshnagar Circle Inspector, uh, namely uh, Shiva Kumar, had, uh, you know, uh, came onto the dais and using his uh, official tab, he just, uh, you know, put it on hold to take a picture after 10 o'clock. So he was just taking a, you know, a, a precautionary measure uh, before, uh, you know, at 9.55. If uh, Akbaruddin Oweisi continues his speech after 10 o'clock, he was ready to take a picture or an evidence of that act. Uh, but what happened here is Akbaruddin Oweisi, while he was addressing, he got disturbed with this act of the police inspector uh, who had previously also, like uh, as Akbaruddin said earlier, he had barged into the private premises of Akbaruddin, Akbaruddin Oweisi and misbehaved is what Akbaruddin had claimed. So this police officer uh, and the police had been claiming that the police officer had not uh, stepped onto the dais. But when we spoke to the election commission in charge or the, the uh, officer there who was in charge of that particular premises, they have told that they did not find any violation by Akbaruddin Awesi. So that is the reason they have not registered any case. But this is the police uh, who, has, who is a complainant in this matter and they have not, nothing to do with uh, uh, the police and uh, the uh, you know violation that has taken place over there. But election commission clearly st stating that Akbaruddin has not violated any uh, you know, uh, election uh, rules or election court by yeah. address uh, during uh, yesterday what he was done. So this clarity had been given, but Akbaruddin obviously also stating that he had a yeah. uh, uh, video evidence of the police officer uh, coming onto the dais and posing uh, with a phone uh, towards him. And this uh, video had been submitted to the ECI. Okay. He's demanded action from the election commission. Let's, of India. let's play out uh, that video also. Let's play out that video. Came. Abdul, thanks very much for joining us with those details. For our viewers, uh, who haven't seen that video just yet. Let's play it out for you. This is Akbaruddin Oweisi, who was holding a rally last night in Hyderabad. He's contesting from Chandrayaan Gutta, so he was there holding a campaign. Remember that the Election Commission Mode of, uh, Model Code of Conduct clearly states that the last the deadline to end all your campaign is 10 p.m. So about five minutes before that, this cop came up to the stage to send out a message that, look, it's time to wrap up. Akbaruddin Oweisi got uh, miffed at that particular uh, uh, step by the cop who came onto the stage, looked at him and then said that if I give the direction right now to the public, you'll have to run for your life. So openly threatened a police officer. A number of reactions have come in on this. His brother, Asaduddin Oweisi, AIMIM chief, has defended Akbaruddin in the sense that he said that there must be a detailed investigation into what's happened. Akbaruddin, as we told you, is claiming that he had prior permission to go ahead with this rally and the action by the cops is motivated. The BJP, on the other hand, has said that this is an attempt by the Oasis once again to take law into their own hands. Let me play out for you the video and the reactions thereafter. जो हमारे तेलंगाना राज्य का जो हमारे होम मिनिस्टर है 
वो एक लबर स्टैम्प है वो कुछ नहीं करते वो सिर्फ जैसे एक समय पर पहले जैसे भारत देश के प्रधानमंत्री मनमोहन सिंह जी थे जो कि कांग्रेस के लबर स्टैम्प थे वैसे ही तेलंगाना राज्य के हमारे होम मिनिस्टर साहब जैसो लबर स्टैम्प बने हुए हाउ दिस एम आई एम पीपुल आर रनिंग ए पैरल गवर्नमेंट इन तेलंगाना दिस नॉट द फर्स्ट टाइम इवन एम आई एम एम एल एस ओपनली सेस इन ए पब्लिक मीटिंग दैट दिस इज नो लॉ इन मजिस एरिया यू डी नॉट पे पावर बिल्स यू नॉट पे वाटर बिल्स You do not seek any permission for building construction. There are no timings for business establishments. You can run for any time. Just because if you vote much this, you get this benefit. This. They are not a law-abiding people. Always they have been violating law. This is how they have been functioning. This is what is reflected. So it's a very clear case. M I M means no law. Y S P means no law. So he has got no respect for the law of the land. they feel they are the masters of the land they do they can get away with anything i think immediately a case should be booked and he should be put behind the bars and let's get you a highlights of chief minister kcr's campaign in revan's reddy's constituency of kodangal and there you had chief minister kcr urging people saying don't vote for revan reddy he's projecting himself to be the next chief minister or the cm face of telangana which he isn't and kcr is also assured that in kamar reddy where he squares off against revanth he says that there's no chance revanth reddy will win he is going to be defeated in kamar reddy defeat him in kodangal as well so this is in fact the comment that kcr has said he's also reiterated his earlier statement saying that the congress will get less than 20 seats in the state of telangana at a time when there's a lot of talk that the congress could actually become serious and fierce competition for kcr's chances of getting a third term as chief minister let's play out for you what the chief minister said nen mukhya mantri ante nen mukhya mantri illu mukhya mantri ayyed ennadu congress gelthe kada congress ki 20 seat kuda raavu ee revanth reddy mukhya mantri ayyed ledu manna ayyed anta vadide gas mukhya mantri ayyed ante meer mosa boy vote lesir anko unna narendra reddy vote adu ayinta mala modati kotha kada ante kada रेवंत रेडी मुख्यमंत्री गाड़ मनु गाड़ अभी ग्यास का सारी नवेंद्र रेडी नरेंद्र रेडी ओक स्थाई आये गेल आये स्थाई पे आये प्रमोशन मन तपक सेवे अवकाश आ फातू रेवंत रेडी मोटल वाले मंत्रीशा वाले नोट कटक ये मोसपोदी मन Okay so the fight between KCR and Revanth Reddy only heating up right now as both are if I going all out in their campaigns the respective parties as I slip into a short break I'm also leaving you with this particular video uh that's going viral of the Telangana Congress uh that's in fact put out a bye bye KCR campaign take a look at this video now that's going viral on social media Askar Ranj lo acting as a TV अट्लो <laughs> watching india today powered by finest be sustainable change a bnp group company high frequency electromagnetic fields will interfere with the functioning of your heart simply put it's your mobile phone which is interfering with the functioning of your heart 
especially when you put it in the left pocket of your shirt and think it's going to do nothing. It's a myth. It will cause you problems. Take a look at this report. Electronic gadgets make life very convenient and bring the world to our fingertips with meals, clothes and vacations just a thought away. But did you know that at the same time, your device is secretly stealing from you the very life that it's making oh so easy? Yes, you heard that right. Your mobile phone may actually increase your susceptibility to cardiovascular diseases. High frequency electromagnetic fields increase the risk of heart disease. These invisible waves impact your heart rate when you keep your mobile near your chest. The radiation from mobile phones increases free radicals, a reactive oxygen species which damage cells and also your DNA. It's been found that mobile phones, earpods and smartwatches are also the leading cause of headaches, numbness in thighs, dizziness and heaviness in the chest. We hope that the penny has dropped and not your phone. With Dhruv Yadav, Bureau Report for India Today. You are watching India Today. Powered by Finest, Be Sustainable Change, a BNP Group company. The world's biggest Hindustani and literature festival is back. It's time for Sahitya Aaj Tak and you can expect a bigger, better lineup than ever before. As stellar luminaries from different fields come together to discuss culture, art, literature and much more. Here's a glimpse of what you can expect from this edition of Sahitya Aaj Tak. Sahitya Aaj Tak is back. The world's biggest Hindustani literature and culture festival returns this month in its grand sixth edition. And this time, things are going to be even bigger. Boasting a stellar lineup, featuring luminaries from across fields and dimensions. From Bollywood, father daughter duo Javed Akhtar and Zoya Akhtar, filmmaker Meghna Gulzar. Actors Vicky Kaushal, Manoj Bajpai and Raj Palyada. Singing their way to a billion hearts, actors, singer and lyricist Piyush Mishra, singers Jubin Nautiyan, Kavita Singh and Adnan Sami. The country's most sought-after poets, Kumar Vishwas and Shailesh Lodha, along with renowned lyricists Manoj Muntashir Shukla and writers Amish Tripathi and Anuja Chauhan. This year's Sahitya promises to surpass all previous records. This year, the event also launches the Ajtak Sahitya Jagriti Samman, a Lifetime Achievement Award along with three awards to promote young talent that elevate Indian literature. Chaired by Ajtak's news director Supriya Prasad, a six-member jury will select winners. With record-breaking registrations in 2022, this year promises to be way bigger. Mark your calendars November 24th to 26th at Delhi's major Dhyan Chand National Stadium. And remember, entry is free once you register at www.archthak.in slash sahitya or by giving a missed call to 931-033-0033. Let the power of words ignite your mind and touch your heart in this celebration of literature, ideas and cultural fusion. All right, that's all we have time for in this broadcast. Thanks very much for tuning in. Same time tomorrow, 6 p.m. I'll be joining you live with a detailed ground report from where I am right now from Nizamabad. Till then, thank you for tuning in. 
You are watching India Today, powered by Finest, Be Sustainable Change, a BNP Group company. You are watching India Today, powered by Finest, Be Sustainable Change, a BNP Group company. Forecast now. Delhi, maximum 27 and minimum 13 degrees. Mumbai, maximum 30 and minimum 26 degrees. Kolkata, maximum 31 and minimum 19 degrees. Bangalore, maximum 27 and minimum 20 degrees. Chennai, maximum 28 and minimum 24 degrees. Hyderabad, maximum 29 and minimum 21 degrees. Make your media plan smarter with India Today Live TV on your connected devices. Amplify your brand with 100 million smart internet viewers. To advertise, mail us at sales at arjthug.com. Nothing like an early morning walk to get the energy going. The minister will become a minister. 50-50. 50-50, I have heard biscuits. Morning walk done. Time for some Rajasthani breakfast at Tapri. Saffron chai. TJP is a big deal. I want to leave this one. I want to leave this one. I want to leave this one. Enjoy Desi Ghee Bajra Ki Roti. I want to fight with the army and I want to fight with the army. watching India Today, powered by Finest, Be Sustainable Change, a BNP Group Company. Presented by Aapka Joy, Bharat Ka Joy, Joy E-Bike. धारो सा टीला पीड़ा माटीरा है ठाट भी ऊंट सवारी रा ओ जपना में कृष्ण मुरारी रा ओ राजस्थान में किसान बार बार बदल बदल के देख रहा है पर वही वही पान के डाट नहीं चोता दोनों एक ही पार्टी है किसान के बारे में कोई सी पार्टी नहीं सोचे हिवड़ा मैं हिवड़ा मैं हिवड़ा इस बार राजस्थान का ये एक पांच साल रहती है बीजेपी पांच साल रहती है कांग्रेस अब इस जीप का नंबर है और जोश भी है इड़ने उड़ने सब ने मैं तो हिवड़ा मैं भी ठावा कांग्रेस की पढ़ सकती है कहाँ तो क्यों उम्मीद है अच्छा काम किया है बहुत बड़े काम कर रहे हैं मेरे साथ लाइट भी मिल रही 